have the one. Yeah, there is this. Yeah, this one. Yeah. Mm. And the, yeah. So this is the beans we use for moi moi. Thank you. Mm. Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to soak these beans for moi moi. I'm not going to soak all of this. Just like half of it. It's really dried. So I'm going to soak it before you go now. So the beans are softened. I left it here for four, five hours and it has softened. So I'm going to wash it out now. Then I'll blend it for moi moi. So let's prepare moi moi with this. All right. So here are the things I'll be using. So here I have my washed beans with um, red bell pepper, onions, I have crayfish here, then I have this foil plate, I'll be using foil plate instead of foil pepper, then I have these ones, I have um, thyme here, I have seasoning powder here, I have, um, I have a salt here, I have curry powder, I have pepper here, then I have my vegetable oil, so let's blend this thing together. to help it you guys remember this <laughs> this is my new blender and this is the first time I'm using it so let me plug it the first time I'm using this blender but I, I can't um, I can't judge it by these beans and this um, this pepper I can only judge it by blending or one or
okay okay two is the highest speed okay maybe if I'm blending something like oh but no maybe I will turn it to two but for something like these beans which is very soft so I think one is a good idea this one has finished blending now so I'm going to transfer it to my bowl then I'll blend the second part so so I'll do the second part of camera okay okay so now I'm going to I'm going to transfer this blended one here Let's see. Uh -huh. Now I'm using I'm using glass jar blender. I cannot see what I'm blending. You know when I'm using that stainless steel, I hardly see what I'm blending. I have to look through the cover before I see what I'm blending. But this one, through the glass, I can see what I'm blending. It it is blended fine, yeah? Okay. So I'm going to blend the second part of camera. Okay. Yeah. Look at that. I'm going to blend the second one off camera. So it's time to spice it. I have to add uh, all this my spice. I'm going to bake it. So I have my pan here. I've added some water here. And I have my foil plate. So I'm going to place it here. Okay. So I'll add just a teaspoon of um, curry powder you know I'm an African mom <laughs> I, I have gauged the quantity so this one is one teaspoon then I'm going to add my curry one teaspoon of this also yeah so I'll add um, this is the pepper I have here so that's why I'm using it I have only black pepper in the house but if you have the other spicy red pepper, you can use it. So this one also is one teaspoonful. Um, then salt. You add salt to taste, but before sauce, let me add. Let me add seasoning powder. So I'm going to put. This is teaspoon. Yeah. So I'm going to put um four teaspoonful of uh, seasoning powder here add salt I'll add two teaspoonful of salt here I'm going to add vegetable oil so what I'm using is canola oil so you can use any oil of your choice so I'll be adding just one cookie spoonful of one cooking spoonful of vegetable oil all right so I'll stir that I will stir. I will stir to combine together. Let's put it right here for baking. Yes, oh, yeah. I, I have um, I have put this one here. That means I'm going to use. Okay, you know what I'm gonna do now? Okay, okay, let me continue. So, we're gonna bake it. Um, you see that I added water to it. So, this one I added water here also. Right, so we're gonna allow it to bake. So, this is the end result. So, show me. Moi Moi is ready now and I want to prepare pap. Yeah, I want to prepare pap for this Moi Moi. 
So if you are not an African, maybe if you're a Korean watching me, you may not understand. This is cornstarch. You know what cornstarch is. So I'm going to prepare it now for my breakfast. So stay tuned and see how African breakfast looks like. All right. So let's prepare this together. This is the cornstarch. I'm going to take, I'm going to take, you know, like, let's say, five, five teaspoonful of uh, cornstarch. It just for me, the kids are not interested. Three, four, five. Okay, let me make it six. Six, okay. Yeah, six. So I'm going to I'm going to dissolve it with water. Yeah. I'm gonna dissolve it with water. Okay. So add water here. I dissolve it. Meanwhile my my water my water is boiling over there. So I have to dissolve it. Yes, baby, I'm coming. This is how we prepare cornstarch for breakfast, okay? Yes, you first of all dissolve it with cold water. Yes, you dissolve it with cold water. Not really refrigerated water, that's room temperature water. Ambient temperature water. So you dissolve it with it, then you bring your water to boil. So let me show you guys, I put my water now. My water is boiling, if you can hear that. Okay. Now the water has boiled. The thing is bubbling, but I'm not going to pour it immediately. I don't know if you can see. The thing is really bubbling, but I'm not going to pour it immediately. I'm just gonna let it let it stop bubbling. Cause if I pour it immediately while it's bubbling, I might have some lumps. So, so I have to make sure that my pap is well dissolved. I have to make sure my pap is well dissolved. So I have to dissolve. I have to stir it again to make sure it's well dissolved. Okay, so I'll pour. Okay. So here it is. Here is my here is my pop. You see that? So let's go and do justice to it. You can add your peanut butter, soy powder, chocolate, sugar, honey, whatever powder you feel like adding it you can add it so but for me i'm going to add it only milk and sugar a sweet combination in African home this is what we have for breakfast this is what we normally have for breakfast yeah. very sweet this is the moi moi I made with Korean beans from my previous video I went to the market to the local market and I bought Korean beans. So this is the moment I made. I made with that beans I bought. <coughs> this is sweet. <coughs> Sweetest combination ever. <coughs> so I don't want this video to be too long. If I continue filming, I'm eating this. Food. See what I'm. If I continue filming. I don't want this video to be too long. I'm going to end it here. Alright. So 
and my baby wants breast milk, so I want to breastfeed him before I start eating this food. You see, it's not easy. Life of a breastfeeding mom, whatever you are doing, once your baby start crying, you abandon that and attend to the baby. So right now, I'm eating my food and he's crying. So I have to abandon this to attend to him. Okay? <laughs>